in discovering the history of Orange. The train in Gordonsville is very important to the history of Gordonsville and it opened up a lot of routes that contributed to trade and travel in the 1860s uh, after the emancipation. Uh, it was very important to the black citizens of Gordonsville. Um, they became entrepreneurs. They would come to the train to meet passengers and they would serve food. Fried chicken being the most famous, but they also sold ham sandwiches and fried pies along with fruit. And as the years went by, it became even more important, especially during the years of the Civil War. Uh, there were many troops that came to Gordonsville, stopped in at the Exchange Hotel. It continued up until around um, the 1940s when the train started um, selling food on the train itself. But it didn't stop those vendors. They started uh, selling food out of their homes. A lot of those recipes are still being used today. During those periods when uh, they cooked, um, it was not only the matriarch of the family, but they included the entire family. It became family business. And uh, those uh, recipes uh, were passed down to families and are very close to him. There is a very famous Gordonsville uh, African-American family that today own a restaurant in the town of Orange, Cooper's Cooking and Catering. And they are very popular. People come from far away to uh, sample the chicken.